10 home design trends that are leaving in 2022. A new year is always time for a fresh start. And yes, that's most definitely the case when it comes to home design trends. For better or for worse, not every look that reigned supreme in 2021 will carry over to 2022. Of course, none of this is to say that any design choices are objectively good or objectively bad. These are just the trends designers think they'll be saying goodbye to sooner rather than later. 1. Open Concept Homes While open concept design plans were a great idea a few years ago, we now know that privacy is a huge part of any design to accommodate the new challenges we are facing every day. Working from home while the children are attending school from the dining room table can make for a very eventful day at the office with an open concept floor plan. More and more, we are understanding that our homes must fit our lifestyle and be fully functional for years to come. Michelle Martel, designer and stylist in Montreal. 2. Cheap replicas. Savvy shoppers and DIYers are finding great well-made vintage pieces and reupholstering or painting them to bring them a fresh look. Lorna Kays, founder of Lorna Kays Interior Design in Philadelphia. 3. Shiplap. Once a hot trend, shiplap is going by the wayside. Unless you live in an actual farmhouse, you may want to consider a faux finish, or better yet, wallpaper. Jennifer Markowitz, founder of JNR Designs on Long Island. 4. All white kitchens. In 2022, I believe we will see kitchens trending away from all white, and instead, we will see the addition of more natural elements and color in the kitchen. Even darker colors like a deep green have already been showing up as a trend. Marlena Tyke, owner and founder of Marlena Tyke Designs on Long Island. 5. All gray interiors. I think that all gray interiors with no personality are over. People want their interiors to feel welcoming like a warm embrace. They want to see bits of their past and the things that they love. Color and prints make you feel happy. And that's what we all need for 2022. Carrie Pilchik, founder of Carrie Pilchik Design in Ridgewood, New Jersey. 6. Minuscule home offices. I think the home office in a closet will go away now that it's relatively safer to spread our wings and work. With one or more adults who were once working from home heading back to the office, kids heading back to school and workouts happening outside of the home, dedicated offices are back. Leah Alexander, founder of Beauty is Abundant in Atlanta. 7. Boho Style. After a year plus of living life in yoga pants and ponytails, I think people are ready to feel, put together, again. Same goes for their homes. I think come 2022, more refined and structured interiors are going to be the thing. Time to polish up. Amanda Thompson, founder of Aline Studio in New York City. 8. Mosaic Tiles. Mosaic floors had their moment until people started spending more time at home and opted for creating more consistent, clean, and serene spaces that were low maintenance and easy on the eyes. Mosaic flooring is being replaced with larger tiles and materials that are easier to clean and blend into the overall soothing and welcoming feeling that a clean space offers. Adam Meshberg, founder and CEO of the Meshberg Group in NYC and Miami. 9. Waterfall Kitchen Islands. Waterfall Kitchen Islands feel done in my opinion. They have seen their heyday and are passing out of popularity because they can often make a kitchen feel too cold and not inviting. Kala Talency, principal at KT2 Design Group in Boston. 10. Harsh Metals. For years, bold metal finishes have been a popular choice to evoke a clean and ultra-modern aesthetic. I recently visited the stunning De Castelli showroom in Milan and was inspired by all the hand patinated, brushed, and satin finishes, and unexpected colors like blushes, deep rust colors, and even steely blues that give warmth to an otherwise sterile material. I foresee these contemporary metals replacing the harsher finishes of the past and am excited to see innovative applications to accent walls, room dividers, 
tables, and bar and kitchen cabinetry. Sarah Ionisiello, Director of Design at Whitehall Interiors in New York City, 1985-1990.